Hey guys, it's me, Mr. Cheese Gaming here, and welcome back to more of Let's Play Pokemon. Really? Welcome back to more of Let's Play Mother 3. You gotta excuse me because I just recorded Pokemon Emerald, specifically the abandoned ship video. It's funny, but I gotta get used to that because for a few weeks I'm gonna take a break from Pokemon Emerald. Anyways, um, last time we. Uh, met Ionia again and learned uh, about the Seven Needles. Apparently there is a dragon sleeping underneath all these islands and um, I, they, and because it was so powerful they had to put it to sleep with Seven Needles, kind of like tranquilizers, and had the Seven Mad Gypsies, um, you know, guard them. But since the needles are being pulled, the mad gypsies are disappearing, and apparently the one pulling them doesn't seem to have a heart of either good or evil. Like, it doesn't have any positive or negative intent at all. Which is strange. Who else besides you could have pulled needle? Incredible power seems to be sleeping here. Must be the dragon. Safe frog over there, and... I love that. I want a ringtone just like that. Actually, I think the ringtones are available like that. Anyways. Commander! Bridge! Hurry here! We have located the next needle! Commander? So apparently the real commander might be pulling the needles. The monkey! We need the monkey! The monkey? The monkey can open it! Open what? Yeah! The one pain in the neck! Anyways, the market's a key. I'll explain the details later. But, but please come to Camaro Lab. Camaro Lab? I assume you know where Camaro Lab is, right? No. Huh? Commander, your voice sounds kind of cheery today. All the darkness here, and Lucas Gill maintains a cheerful nature. That is what makes Lucas awesome, because he's like, no. Anyways, Commander. Well, anyways, please take the crossroad train to the factory. When you arrive, go west to the rope point station that's behind the factory. Did you get all that? Yes. Oh, and if you know where it is, then there's no problem at all. Please hurry. Got a transceiver. It's gonna be useless. Anyways, Ionia, you have anything else to say? Back to Tasmania. Right there. I'm worried about my own needle now. Just a note, we'll meet again. But if we don't, then that means one of us has, to, has left this world. Bye bye! If you go down here, you unlock the door, and hey, it's that door that we haven't been to that we couldn't open back in Chapter 3. My cheery skeleton is still there, and that guy still has a butt. But anyways, here we are, the bro team. They are basically the two um little bros to get put together. I'll run away if I can yeah they're powerful and the cheery skeleton I'll take care of the chili skeleton they shouldn't be too tough use a combination attack what is this pick a fire and they attack twice Running away, couldn't run. Oh, the flames went out. Another combination attack. We're running away, come on, come on, run! Okay, Lucas survived, but... Hurry up! Oh my god!
These guys really are tough. Nothing to mess around with. I'm still gonna get his back straight, though. Very lucky back attack, Ken. Bo double buck! As you can notice, they can also use PK Freeze. As well as a PK Thunder... Not fi Thunder, but Fire Combo finally took you out. Have less HP than I suspected. Jeez, uh, keep on using Life Up. Because they are crazy tough. Oh, great, there's another one. Actually, they're all um, bro teams now. Might as well get out of Osoe Castle. And we can't go in there again, so make sure that you got the bro teams back sprite. Never mind, there are plenty more bro teams here. Run away from these guys. They are evil. That's why I like the Lilo sweater. Saves you from instant KOs. And the stinky ghosts are running away. They're still here, really? Sorry, Lucas, but your omelette's patch no longer exists. You found something else, Pony? Whoa, what are you doing? Ah, oh, snip light. Too bad that uh, he doesn't really have much importance to the story. He only appears a few times, but he's cool. Alright, have you seen Flint? He was just here visiting Yanar's grave. He's probably headed back to the mountains yet to look for the clouds. Look for Klaus, visit her now's grave. Look for Klaus, visit her now's grave. It's all your old man does anymore. That, that's sad. It really is. His only salvation is you, Lucas. You've grown so strong that Flint doesn't need to worry anymore. You've grown up to be a truly good lad. Here, Flint gave this to me. He asked to give it to you the next time you came by. Supposedly, it's a good luck charm your pops treasured since he was boy himself. A courage badge, huh? This actually led to a few theories, but anyways. Visit Hinawa's grave. Same cutscene as before. My folk song. Great! Hold on one second, guys. Okay, sorry about that. My parents actually just came home from doctor's appointment. They're looking to change their medications, anyways. We'll head down since we finally got our courage badge. Another phone call. Commander, where, where are you? Dakota? Dakota. No, no, I'm just spouting nonsense. Everyone is waiting at the Camaro lab. Well, even being arrived, they still haven't arrived yet, you know. The, 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 the reason being I forgot how to get there. I mean, I understand the directions, but... To get to the Camaro lab, you take the crossroad to the factory, and then head west from the world base station. The problem is, I don't know where I am right now. Hello? Are you alright, Commander? I, oh, oh, I see the Camaro lab now. You were right. Take the crossroad and train at the factory and end rest from the road main stick then. Idiots. Anyways, ah, uh, finally, Savior. I can finally deposit. I know, so I don't need anymore. 
Alright, uh, get rid of the flying chart, because we're probably going to keep the illegal Leo sweater for a long time. To be a card too. Uh, let's see, friends yo-yo. What else, what else? So we have on keeping... I have no, not a whole lot of use for the bug spray. Anyways, so what else, what else? Actually, I don't think I have anything else. I'll get rid of that anti-paralysis since I do have healing. Is your banana? I don't really use. Saltwater gun? I don't really use. Killer cheese, secret herb, yoga, fenting, bomb. Okay, I'll keep all these. Alright. So, I'm gonna just go ahead and take the crossroads. What do you guys say? Much less exhausting. They're so inexpensive and inviting. Liar! They cost $2,500. A mere 50. Oh, you changed the price. Well, you're right. Sure. How about taking the green train? The green one costs a little bit more, though. By the way, they're green trains. Basically, the only difference is that the green train will play different music. Many people thought that this music was unused, but no, you can hear it play when you're taking the green train. Huh, really? 200 DP for two pickets. Not enough money. Alright, I'll talk to a frog then. But yeah, all it is is that it'll change music, and many people thought that um, the music that is plays when you take the green tra train is unused, but... No, that's not the case. It's, it's just that uh, it's in a very certain area. That not a lot of people take into consideration. Yeah, you guys probably the green one. Uh, green one as opposed to the red one. How do they share the same tracks? Well, I'll be quiet for the music, even though I'll get a copyright strike, but I don't care because I don't make money from this. All aboard! Yeah, I can't believe that many people thought this music was unused. There's different music as well if you take the Red Train, but that's the song that most people are more familiar with. Experience the joy of riding a green train. I guess Lucas likes the color green. New enemy right here. Alright, got a back attack. This is why you wanted the... Squawking stick on um, back sprite because it's replaced by the squawking boom sticks. All right, turn around. I think they also explode. Yeah, it does. All right, take them out. Too bad we don't get any experience if they explode, but hey, at least we got um both their sprites. Anyways, here's a factory. If you actually need more money, you can actually go ahead and work for Mr. Brown again, then. Stop. Whoa. The factory's going to be shut down soon, they ain't. Or the clay, or the factory. Uh, I'm being sent to New Pork City. Huh? New Pork City. Thanks for everything. Okay, never mind. You can't work here anymore. I actually did not know that. I thought you can work here until the end of the game. 
Oh, there's a mole. No, come on, uh, when you want to get in your knocked out. Uh, sheesh. Anyways, there's tons of new enemies that I'm um, here. Like, um, the bad gang Juan is now replaced by this abomination of nature. The horse Angela. Oh god, it looks like it's in pain. I admit, I always found this guy to have a very creepy design. Come on. A ton of HP. Thankfully, Leo Leo's letter kept Lucas alive, and there's an antidote in case it poisons you. Like I said, they're pretty powerful. Like, level 35 is pretty much where all the enemies are, and since you're basically stuck with Lucas a pony, they're gonna be tough. So I actually recommend avoiding many of these enemies for quite a while. And wow, there's a kettle snake there. Anyways. Um, when they're saying that the monkey is the key, well, take a look. There's a door here. Dancing figures are depicted. That is what they were talking about. They appear behind yeah, the strange type of door in the mirror of cocky forest. Yes, the one of the monkeys in the end. Hey, keeps the boom. Broken out of his cage and running loose and say... Sorry, it's cooled out. <laughs> Anyways, please send reinforcements. Ah, hey you. That's the key to... Uh okay. Anyways, oh god. This is a very I like this design very much. The Austral event. Unfortunately, it's really freaking powerful. So I'll take it out pretty fast. I take it back, it's not that powerful at all. Okay. This thing also has a chance of dropping a fresh egg that you can heal up and turn into a hot spring egg at the hot springs, which conveniently is right there. Never mind! It's not the Australian elephant, I'm talking about this one. Wow, you can drop eggs at will, so now you can finally go to the hot springs to turn it into a hot spring egg. So this is very cool because you can get infinite hot spring eggs this way. Because they'll, because he'll keep. Uh, I can't believe I said he. She'll stop. Keeps dropping eggs so long as your inventory allows it. Allows to receive more eggs. Okay. Let's go down already. Thank you. And what's this? Oh, you're in that part time working from the other day. Perfect timing. Keep watch for me, will ya? I'm gonna go inside and help look for some escape monkeys. Well, I'm not gonna stay outside. I'm gonna go right in. And take a look at that. It's like the actual building is a Camaro itself. Anyways. It's a movie theater here. I started here today, right? Okay, cool. You go, you go through in the Magnum Theater. Up. Yeah, just in case you know, you know, in there and change your clothes. Get out of there, you brood. Hey. Oh, it's a robot. The Camaro Theater is currently closed. There's a vending machine here. Anything interesting? Very good stick. Good for Lucas. So, I'll get that from the safe frog. Well, money to pay for it, huh? Because here's a frog right here. Okay, that's $2,000. Do 
Do I have enough? Yes, I have enough inventory space, so... So, if you did not get the, um, better stick for... Well, the good stick for Lucas, don't worry, because there's a better item right here. Alright, got rid of my good stick. That's awesome. So I'll go ahead and deposit my items. Well, not save. And not uh, deposit my items, I mean deposit my TP. Man, I'm just not saying the right words. Anyways, um, like they said, there are some escape monkeys here. I guess our job is to catch Celso so we can get through the door and be able to reach the needle. Hopefully before the real commander finds out about this place. Anyways, next time on Let's Play Mother 3, we're gonna go through this place and hopefully find Celso. Well, I'll see you guys next time. Well... Of course, if you like this video, leave behind a like, leave behind a comment if you like, and if you want to see more Mother 3 videos, go ahead and subscribe. I'll see you guys then.